guys how are you today Lucia here from laughing with an accent I hope you're doing amazing welcome back to my channel on this channel I do subscription box unboxing so if you're into that I'd love to have you subscribe and if you're not new welcome back and thank you so much for stopping by again today I have a brand new subscription to our channel and maybe you've never heard of it but this is the happy endings book box and look how pretty that is a rose and it says one spicy novel at a time and this is a quarterly book subscription box with romance steamy novels so let me give you some more info i believe it's 84.99 a month i was having it open um and you get five novels and some other bookish items so while the page loads i will start opening this up and a funny story about happy endings i didn't know what he meant and i don't know if you remember but there was a show called happy endings it was it was hilarious it was really funny and it wasn't nothing like explicit or uh, maybe there were jokes that i didn't understand they had double meaning but i kept telling my friends like oh my gosh happy endings is so funny and my friend was like you know what happy endings means right i'm like and she told me about it and i was like okay <laughs> so Happy reading and happy endings. <laughs> I hope I don't get canceled uh, by YouTube by sharing this. Hope not. But we have beautiful tissue paper that I'm always like really glad to open. And then I can take a nice picture of the page. Oh, of the uh, box closed. But maybe I can recreate it. Ooh, okay. There's a ton of stuff in here. I'm so excited. Okay. Happy endings, one spicy novel at a time. Do you read romance novels? I go through phases where I do. I love Aris Gray. She's a really funny um, rom-com writer. We have a little letter here. So, ooh, okay. It says, Happy Endings Book Box. Thank you for choosing Happy Endings Book Box. We hope you enjoy these spicy novels as much as we do. The list below is what we have included in our winter box. So again, you get it four times a year. It's 84... Um, my internet is really slow, sorry. And then we have five bookish goodies. So really good price, I think, for five novels and five bookish goodies. I think that's really good. And, uh, or maybe more. And they, she signed it, I can't remember the name, Marcy, sorry. I'll find out and um, correct that. But uh, let's get into it. I see, oh my gosh, I see a snack. Let's start with this snack because I just saw it. Double stuffed Oreos. What? Issued, it says. Okay, so it's relating to one of the books. The double stuffed Oreo is in honor of Jim's favorite snack. Love that. Okay, so that is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Okay, that's a sweet treat, one of the items. Um, so let's start with the books. Ooh, Wicked Wolf by Reese Spencer. And there's a lady in the cover. This is a, bra a new thing, right? We normally have a man in ab covers or chest covers. But this time, okay, so the guy is kind of like hugging her. I can see his hand. Wicked Wolf. Okay. Oh, the guy's name is Dorian. Ooh, Dorian, and what's her name? I only see Dorian. Olivia. Wolf is not just his name. It's who he is. An apex predator always on the hunt. The gray wolf has become synonymous with the name Dorian Wolf. It's a brand he's worked hard, hard to build. He's at the top of the food chain, dependent on no one. He makes the rules and he has only one. Do not F with me. <laughs> when everything he thought he knew about himself begins to change, he knows it is because of her. Her scent haunts him. And after one taste, he knows it will never be enough. His prey has a name, Olivia Frost. Really cool. <laughs> Sounds really fun. I kind of like that the frost and the wolf, I don't know, kind of gives me winter vibes. <laughs> um, then we have, ooh, by Jay Kenner, My Fallen Saint in a nice a velvety cover. And... Oh, this retails for $12.99. We have retail values, Noel, for you. Um, and this is, his touch is her sin. His, her love is his salvation. I wonder if this is, 
about like a priest or something. Um, a brilliant investor with a Midas touch, Devlin Saint, turned a modest inherited fortune into billions and now operates one of the world's foremost international philanthropic organizations. He's a man determined to help the unprivileged, to fight injustice, and to make the world a better place. And that, at least, at least is true. It's not, however, the full truth. Because Devlin Saint is a man with a dangerous secret. One he'll do whatever it takes to protect. And when investigative reporter Elle Holmes, Holmes, Sherlock Holmes, turns her attention to an unsolved murder, she finds herself caught in a wave of intrigue and passion as Devlin draws her closer and closer. But as he, as the intensity and sensuality of the relationship grows, so do Ellie's suspicions, until she's no longer certain. If the heat between her and Devlin is real, or only a facade, he constructed to hide his dark and twisted secrets. My English is terrible, but I'm hoping I can give you an idea of the book. Ooh, then we have a wind, uh, sorry, issued. I like, ooh, this is Navy Seals of Little Creek series, I think it is, by Paris Winter, and it's an autograph book, and it's called Issued. She needs a total life reboot, even if it means marrying a stranger. Like that. Is this kind of like a love, you know, hate lovers? Taya Maverick has just volunteered to marry a random Navy SEAL as part of the military's new spouse matching program. Is that a thing? What other choice does she have? Her former best friend killed her father and torched her house. Taya is determined to start over, but to be safe, she has to disappear. The program is the perfect opportunity, complete with refuge and a built-in bodyguard. Her Navy SEAL husband can keep her safe, right? After one spectacularly distressed, disastrous marriage, Jim Stevens nixes round two. But his commanding officer never accepts no for an order. While an injury may be while an injury might have silenced him temporarily, Jim still needs to salvage his career after a mistake in combat puts him in leadership crosshairs. Being the first in the pilot program guarantees him a rank and eventual active duty clearance, as long as he can last the trial year. The I do's are barely uttered before Jim and Taya realize they've each miscalculated. Their sizzling chemistry might let lead. Oh. Their sizzling chemistry might lead to bed, but neither is prepared to open their heart. And then Taya's boss comes knocking. This was really, really interesting. I like that idea of like marriage, arranged marriage, turn into love. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> this is funny. Big Ben. Um, hello, handsome stranger. Uh, it began with betrayal. It ended with murder. She was never supposed to cross my path. She was never supposed to know about the currency of secret secrets and oaths of blood. But like a thief in the night, she stole my soul, even if she wasn't mine to possess. As a member of the elite, I live simply by ten. I live by simple tenets. A gentleman above all. Private matters stay private. Secrets whispered are never revealed. Enemies and friends are of the same coin, and power is kin. Power is king. My name is Ben Covington, and I know my sins. Ooh. These also really are something that I would read. I know, like, I don't always read steamy novels, but they don't sound cheesy, you know? They sound, like, really interesting. I love this cover. This is so pretty. Oh my goodness, it says Delicately by M. Jane Early from the author of Before We Get Carried Away. When tragedy flips Ellie, jo Ellie Jamison's life upside down, she retreats from the busy Seattle skyline to the quiet beachside town of California of Arroyo Grande. I don't know that town. She leaves behind the life she's always known to try and start over, heal her heart, and move forward. A uh, self-proclaimed bibliophile, Elle discovers a used bookstore in the village and within it a handsome and recently widowed bookstore owner named Aiden Wilson. Remembering her past, Elle adamantly denies herself another chance at love with Aiden or anyone else. Aiden desperately misses his wife but doesn't want to stop living because she's gone. He submerges himself in his business and attempts to move forward without the love of his life. When Aiden meets Elle, she brings mystery and charm but mostly a shattered heart. She refuses to tell Aiden about her life in Seattle, making him hesitant to trust her. But Aiden's own secrets. Is it Elle? 
But with Aiden's own secrets, is it Elle that should be cautious about going moving forward with him? Ooh, this also sounds really cool, you guys. Oh, there's something inside. Oh, we have some postcard from the author, and this is the other book of hers. This book, all these books sound really good, and not they're not necessarily like giving me a lot of steamy vibes or anything. It's just the stories sound really interesting. Am I the only one here or what? Okay, so we have some bookmark by the delicately author Jane Early. We have the yummy uh, snack, which I really appreciate. Ooh, a sticker by Jane Early too. That's really cool. Okay, and then we have some bookish goodies. I don't know why I'm so excited, you guys. I don't know, but I am. I love books. I love bookish goodies and book boxes. We have a wine tumbler. It says happy endings. Uh, <laughs> this is going to be really weird to parade around, I have to say. Okay, I have to say. Uh, one spicy novel at a time, but it's a really nice velvety uh, black. Really nice. And you can hide these. I mean, you can hide your wine in here because everyone thinks you might be having coffee. We have a straw as well. Then, what else we have? I'm going to pull out all the items because there's so many. We have write your own story bookmark, like a magnetic bookmark. Then we have a bracelet, and I think it came in this velvety bag, but it came off. And it says, you are my sunshine. Oh, I love that. We always tell Walter, you know, because he, my, my two-year-old son has albinism. And we always sing, you are my sunshine, because our sunshine boy. That is so cute. And I love these adjustable. So let me show you. You are my sunshine. It says, very cute bracelet. Love that. Okay, I'll put it here. We have a book sleeve too, you guys. This is so beautiful. Romantic Reads. Oh my gosh. By, oh, Book Bow. Okay. And it has a zipper. Oh my gosh. That's really nice. Book Bow is kind of like a big uh, maker of these. Um, this is super cute. See, Book Bow. And it has a zipper. This is really nice. It's kind of small, but I think all the books in this box fit. No, not all of them. But I love these. This one. Yeah, so some most of them fit. It's because it's a smaller, more smallish one. But it's really nice to put in your purse, and the book doesn't get damaged. How cute! Oh my gosh! Let me do a close up so you can see all the books. This is so gorgeous, you guys. So pretty. Oh my gosh! I can't read. I want to read all these books at once. I'm not kidding. This is super pretty, super, super. Okay, and then we have other goodies in here, prepared goodies. We have a Happy Endings book box bookmark, and we have some free book offer for a limited time. Tainted Bond is the first book in the Bonded series. It's free when you subscribe to my newsletter by Reese Spencer. Reese Spencer is the writer of the first book, Wicked Wolf. So you can get a free book if you subscribe to her newsletter, and that is reesspencer.com. And then we have some information about my Fallen Saint. And I think there's a series you got. So we have my Fallen Saint, and then in the 26th of this year, January this year, we have my Beautiful Sin, and then in May, we have My Cruel Salvation, and I wonder if it's all like a series of the same characters, or maybe not. Maybe not. I don't know. So we'll see. I have to read it and tell you if there's a cliffhanger. So let's do a little recap. This box was really, really amazing. We got five books, and we have issued you know, Big Ben, and issued has... Uh, Autograph. Auto. Uh, it says much appreciation, Paris Winters. Then we have delicately and my fallen saint. And then we have wicked wolf. We have a beautiful book sleeve. 
the bracelet. We have uh, some bookmarks, stickers, the sweet treat that I thought it was awesome, and the wine tumbler. So, do I have everything? Oh no, I'm forgetting the um, magnetic bookmark. So, let's see. Bracelet retails for $9.99. The book bow sleeve retails for $17.99. The wine tumbler retails for $26.99. Um, and then the books, Wicked Wolf retails for $12.99, My Fallen Saint for $16.99, Delicately, Delicacy, oh no, Delicately, $10.99, uh, My Fallen Saint, $16.99, um, Issued, $9.99, and Big Ben, $10.99. So there's a lot of retail value here. I think the books alone are about like, are about like $60 or more um plus all the goodies you get more um you get a lot for your back in this box i think it's awesome i mean you get five bucks uh sweet treat wine tumbler the um this alone is so beautiful i love the book sleeve and a sweet treat a snack what else can you ask in a nice book box skinny romance novels so let me know what you guys think i know some of you will love this box uh because i know you, you love to read this kind of novels like carrie from carrie's nest i will definitely tell her about this box i don't know why i haven't talked to her about this already because she loves romance novels uh but there's some certain you know she likes a certain type and i think these will be right up her alley so anyway if you haven't checked her out carrie's nest she does unboxings as well and she doesn't have the same boxes that i do so you will see new things as well and again if i have a code i will leave it down below i'd love to hear your thoughts you guys about this box happy endings book box please give this video a thumbs up thank you so much for joining me on another video i will see you on my next one or my lives on thursdays bye guys